Sing when? A lion. A lion. How about this one? Oh my goodness. <sighs> this moment, children. And how about this one? What is this? Can you see it on your screen? Yeah. Okay. Hippo. It's an hip it's a hippo. How about this one? One of the endangered species that we have studied last time. What's Rhinos. the name of this one? Okay, rhinoceros. Okay. How about this one? How about this one, children? What is this? Gorilla. Gorilla. Oh my goodness, what's happening with this one? <sighs> Can you see now? Okay, how about this? Zebra. Zebra. How about this? Crocodile. Crocodile. How about this one? Oh, elephant. 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 How about this one? Giraffe. 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 And this? Monkey. 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 Great job. <laughs> and how about this one? Bear. Great job. This one? Panda. Panda. Panda is one of the... Very good. Okay, how about this one, children? Okay, you guess what animal is this? We're going to have a little bit activity for now. Mm -hmm. What is this? Hippo. A hippo. Great job. This one is a hippo. Okay, one more. How about this one? Panda. Panda. Great job. It's a panda. Okay, how about this one? Tick, tick. Elephant. Elephant. Great job. This one is an elephant children. Doo, doo, doo. How about this one? Tiger. Tiger. Great job. This one is a tiger. Ding, ding. Okay, so that's the end. Okay, so those are just an example of wild animals. Okay, so wild animals, you, you can see them in the mountains or in the forest. They are living in the jungle. Okay, so wild animals are differ in the with wild animals are differ with domestic animals. So domestic animals you can see in the farm or in at home. Okay, you have a pet like dogs, cat. They are domestic animals. Okay, so wild animals you cannot you cannot see them at home. You can see them in the zoo. You can see them in the zoo, children. Okay, so one more. So we have an, a, a little bit one one here. I still have one more. How about this one? What is this? They are funny animals, wild animals. So this one is a bear. One more, chimpanzee. So we're just going to have this one. What is this? Crocodile. Crocodile. How about this one? The elephant. Elephant. How about this one? What is this? Fox. 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 A fox. Great job. This one, oh my goodness. He's good in climbing. Yeah. 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 Climbing a tree. Yeah. Okay, how about this one, children? Oh, this one is already an endangered animal. You have watched the video last time, right? This one. What is this? A hedgehog. Mm, hedgehog. Okay, one more. Hip. Oh. 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 How about this one? 
开始，开始。来啊！来，来，来，来！来 ，Rhinoceros。啊 ，Rhinoceros。Rhinoceros。你。嗯哼。One more。Tiger。Tiger。嗯哼。Tiger。Dolphin, dolphin, dolphin. Oh, hey, 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 hey. How about you? Ah, about this one. Okay, I already saw dancing. Wolves. How about this one? Yeah, zebra. 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 Okay, so the an example of wild animals. Let's see another one. Hey, yeah. Let us. Hey. Yeah. Okay. So those are just some examples of wild animals. So we're going to have another one. We're going to have a video about wild animals. Just a moment, children. Smile and learn. I love them. Today we're going to learn about them, but it's already night time. I'll use my torch to find them. There's a silhouette over there. Which animal would that be? It's a lion. Lion. The lion is the king of the jungle. The lion. Lion. I see another silhouette over there. Let's find out what animal that is. It's an elephant. Elephant. The elephant is huge. Elephant. Let's see what other animals we can spot. Giraffe. That's quite a neck, isn't it? Giraffe. Let's see what we'll find in this tree. Tree. Monkeys are so funny. Monkey. Let's see what's down there. It's a crocodile. Crocodile. Look at those teeth. Crocodile. There's another silhouette. What would that be? <laughs> Gorillas are very strong. Gorilla. Over oh, oh, oh. here. Zebra stripes are so cool. Zebra. Let's see if we can spot more wild animals. Tigers are fierce. Tiger. What else have we got here? A rhinoceros. Rhinoceros. My, my, look at that horn. Rhinoceros. Another animal around. Sure there is. A bear.
Can you hear anything, children? No. Okay, so this is just the vocabulary of the animals that you have seen a while ago. So we have the tiger. We have the rhinoceros. Rhinoceros should be bear. One more. Wolf. Okay, so those animals are living in the jungle, children. So last time we studied about the animals of being the endangered animals so we're going to go back go back to the animal extension so that you can you can relate to our topic for today for today because our topic for today is about the animal protection okay the animal protection what does they do for those animals who are endangered endangered meaning they are extinct they are being they are in the verge of extinction okay like like the you know before we have before we have the dinosaurs right but then because of natural natural causes that meteorite or asteroids asteroids hit the planet earth all the the dinosaurs are dead right they are all dead so they are extinct meaning they are not they are not what do you mean by that they are not in our planet Earth for now, okay? They, they, they are not exist. They did not exist in our Earth, in the planet Earth now. Okay, so now we're going to have the animal extinction. We're going to go back for our last topic so that you can relate. Animal extinction caused by humans, okay? So we're going to have the animal extinction caused by humans. So we're going to have this one. No, we already have that one. And last time, did I let you do something in your notebook? Did I let you do something in your notebook, children? Okay, so we're going to have this one. This one is one of the reasons why animals are being endangered for now. Because of human... So we're going to have this one. Just a moment. I will just go in to show you my screen, children. Mm -hmm. Effect of human on wildlife habitats because of deforestation and energy resources. Can you see my screen now, children? A chat? No. Okay, here we go. I think it's coming out. It's coming out. There you go. There you go. Mrs. Coco, there were a lot of trees when I visited this forest last month. What happened? Okay, we're going to go back, go back, go back, go back from last month. Okay. This one is in cartoons, children, animation. Okay, so last month, they vis visited the forest with a lot of trees. Okay, so we're going to have first the deforestation, cutting down of trees for the human. We're going to plant for farming, for agriculture. They're going to plant the forest with rice in different crops okay so the, the other one is for building houses in buildings okay for making the forest a village there you go look at this one it's a forest a lot of trees and then one month later we cut down the trees Mrs. we cut Coco, down the trees and we build buildings spiky they were cut down there are many reasons why people cut down trees they cut them for wood or to clear the land for okay, construction so what is, of houses. So what is the first reason why people cut down trees? According to this video, children. Sophia? For building houses. For building... No, no, no. The first one. The first one in the video that you have seen a while ago. For woods, for wood children. Okay, next we have the second. 
we have the second what is the second reason to for human houses. okay for the construction of houses and buildings houses and buildings sometimes forests are cleared for mining as well what else this what is else the third one what for is the forest the, for mining mining what mining minerals in the ground okay so they cut down that what it says deforestation okay now deforestation is the destruction of forests okay so what does deforestation means deforestation is the destruction of forests to make the land available for other uses for other uses means for building for building houses in buildings in what else for mining also to cut down the trees okay so that's the one reason why animals go extinct or in danger or they go disappear because of human activity the first one is deforestation now we're going to move on to another one children to make the land available for other uses that's so sad the scenery used to be much better with the trees mm -hmm. yes but deforestation affects more than just the beauty of a place it also has a negative impact on the environment the roots of the trees hold the soil together. When we remove the trees, the soil is exposed and often blown away by the wind or washed away by rain. The eroded soil is deposited in rivers and streams, blocking the flow of water. The water level in the rivers then rises rapidly, causing floods. Also, when okay, so when this stops when we erode, plant growth becomes impossible, and the so when we cut down trees, what will happen, children? What does the trees does to our soil, to the soil? Anybody? We're going to have a recitation. Okay, the root of the trees, we're going to hold the soil, okay? So they protect us from flood. So if humans, we're going to cut the trees, they're not going to, okay? So if they're going to cut the trees, the trees will no, no trees will no longer hold the soil. So if rain were going to come out, we're going to, if it were going to rain, there would be a flood. There would be a flood. One more. Of the course. land becomes barren, like a desert. This is known as desertification. Oh no, Mrs. Coco, we are harming the environment on such a large scale. Not only the environment, Spikey, we are also harming the wildlife. This includes okay. wild What else do we harm when we cut down the trees? What else? the wild animals because mm -hmm. we have we studied before that wild animals okay so wild animals live in the cave or under the tree okay so the trees gives food and shelter for the wild animals so if they're going to cut down the trees for if we're going to have the deforestation okay the deforestation the animals will no longer house to live no longer food to eat and of course when people when humans saw these animals they're going to hunt them for food okay that's one of the reasons why we have an animal instinct extinction for now okay now we're Plants going to move animals. on when we cut trees down we are leaving less space for animals to live think there about all the animals that live in forests Mm -hmm. Where would they go if we destroy those forests? Of course, we the people are destroying would them. their homes. Also, animals that eat plants for food, what would they eat? As a result, many animals do not survive and okay. sometimes so what will even happen? go extinct. On top okay. of that, you see this one. On top of that, 
Human hunt and kill animals too. For what? For food. The main reason is for the meat of the animals. In second, for the other parts of animals that they're going to use to make bags or access bags, shoes, any accessories, human accessories. So this is bad. That's why most animals go instinct because Humans of human hunt activities. and kill animals too. There you go. Yes. Hunting is one of the major factors contributing to the extinction of wildlife species. Sadly, we don't stop there. Apart from deforestation and hunting, we have polluted the air, land, and water. What happened? What's the reason why animals go instinct too, children? Anybody? You already you can see that on your screen. Repeat again, please. Okay. Why? What is the reason why go animals go instinct? Another human activity. For cutting down trees. For cutting down trees. Okay, that's the number one reason. What else? And burning the forest. Burning the forest. Great job. What else? For polluting the land and for polluting the water. If, okay, if humans were gonna pollute the water, the aqua, okay, the, the animals that live in the water were gonna die. Children were gonna die. You see this one? They put the garbages on the water, causing the water a water pollution. So, how about this one? They put the garbages on the land also. So, it were gonna have a land pollution also. Now we're going to move on. Hmm. How would you feel if someone pollutes your home? You might end up being sick. This is what humans are doing to animals and their habitats, Spikey. This is so sad, Mrs. Coco. How are humans polluting air, land and water? Can we there stop this? The major sources of pollution are industrial processes, And electricity to fuel every day. The burning of fossil fuels produces 21.3 billion tons of carbon dioxide per Okay, so children, again, human activity. Okay, so if we're gonna burn, okay, so polluting the air, the number one that contributes the pollu the air pollution is industrial waste, okay? So if you're gonna, if, if people were gonna burn fuel for electricity, you're gonna, we're gonna have a carbon dioxide, a lot of carbon dioxide. So if people were gonna cut down the trees, no one will gonna absorb the, no more trees will gonna absorb the carbon dioxide. So it goes in the air. Anyway, if it goes, in the air, in the atmosphere, it will gonna cause what is it? Global warming. Okay, global warming. It will gonna cause a change of temperature. Temperature change again. Again, it will gonna kill animals also. Okay, now we're going to move on. Per year, it is estimated that natural processes can only absorb about half of that amount. So there is an increase of 10.65 billion tons of atmospheric wow. carbon dioxide per year. Plants can absorb carbon dioxide. This but is what I we am are telling you. Them down. Yes, you the number of trees is decreasing and the amount of carbon dioxide released go is increasing. In the atmosphere. One day we will run out of fossil fuels and won't be able to burn them. Mm -hmm. You're right. They will run out one day, which is why we should try shifting to renewable energy sources, such as solar, wind, and water to preserve fossil fuels as well as our environment. Also, renewable energy sources are environmentally friendly and don't cause pollution. To summarize, Deforestation is the permanent destruction of forests to make land available for other uses. Hunting, deforestation, pollution of air, land, and water affect wildlife and their habitats. The burning of fossil fuels is a major cause of pollution. 
Okay, so children, this is just a brief, brief summary of what you have seen a while ago. So deforestation is one of the one, one of the permanent destruction of forests to make land av available for other uses. So we have here hunting, deforestation, pollution of air, land and water. We're gonna affect wildlife, wildlife in their habitats. Okay, next we have the burning of fossil fuel is a major cause of pollution. So if there would be a pollution, the animals were gonna be affected also, not only us, but on, but for also animals, children. So the fishes, will, if they're going to have a water pollution, the world up will, will gonna be affected also. Okay, so one more thing. We're gonna stop in here. So could you please give me, give me animals that is being extinct for now? You have, you have watched that one last time. Can you please give me or name an animal that is endangered? Sophia. A polar bear. A polar bear. Okay, so you have watched that one before then, that because of the temperature changes, the ice in the the Arctic region melts, melts down. Okay, so the polar bear were nowhere to live, so they have to go to the land. So it's very hot, okay? And we're gonna cause them a dehydration. And what else? They doesn't have food to eat anymore, okay? No house to live, no, no place to live, no food to eat. So they will cause them death, okay? Very good, polar bear, what else? What else? What else, still when, aside from polar bear? Sophia? Sophia said a polar bear. Great job. One point. Anybody else, aside from polar bear? Focus one. Do you know, do you know some? Fine. What else? Penguin. What else? Sophia, you want to try again? A rhinoceros. A rhinoceros. What else? Focus one, you want to try? Yeah. Okay, go on. Focus one. A penguin. A penguin. Is it in the verge of extinction? Any other animal? Data for trying. What else? What else? Children. Aside from polar bear, a rhinoceros. What else? Sophia. An orangutan. Orangutan, great job. What else? You have what? Ten animals. And then we have played a video again. Another, some animals also, also in there. What else? The leopard. Monkeys, monkeys, are they still okay? Orangutan is in the family of monkey. What else? What else, children? Elephant. Elephant. Elephant is one. Big job. Yeah, yeah. What else? Bear. A bear. Big job. What else? Go on. I. Crocodile. Did we have that crocodile as one of the ten animals before? Who is that? Who answered the one? Is that yeah, yeah? Okay. What else? A giraffe. Giraffe. Not really. Another answer. A turtle. 
a turtle that it doesn't look like a common turtle but it's just have it lives in the island also okay what else aside from those boom 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 So we have also the rhinoceros, the elephant, what else? The panda. Panda is also extinct. Okay, so we're going to have another one, children. Okay, didn't you aware of the burning of, who is that? Someone Ooh. just messaged me. Lion. Boom, lion. Okay, they are in the zoo. But of course, they are extended already. Okay, what else? Huh? What is that, Sophia? Again, please. Tigers. Tigers. Also. Okay. Now we're going to move on, children. Have you aware of the burning of Amazon before? It kills some, some of the endangered animals. So we're going to have this one first. And then we're going to go on with our topic for the animal protection okay let's see the burning burning of the amazon before amazon forest didn't you know that amazon is considered as the lung lungs of the planet earth because it has a lot of trees okay but then last time the burning of amazon forest was happened when 2019 a lot of endangered animals was burned down okay so we're going to have this one let's see Fires burning, this one, a lot of wild animals in a little bit very sad. It's a little bit very sad video. So just a moment, I was just going to show you, children. This is about wild animals also being burned down. Not, not for food, but for some politics reason. They said it's some politics reason also. So we're just going to... Because it's not in our lesson. We're just going to go on with the with the animals that being burned down so here you go okay so this is the amazon i i know you are aware of the amazon forest right you know amazon forest right yeah okay This is about the burning of forest in the air. Tem, não tem lá água no, no molha, né? O campo que tá seco demais. Mas são três meses já sem chuva. Vai lá se chover agora esse tempo. Tomara you cannot, que you cannot understand this one. You cannot understand this one. Here we go. This one is about the deforestation of the Amazon forest. But I think this is not about just deforestation of the Amazon. Something happened about the political, something like that one. But then they just said that some, some of the, anyway, it's not our lesson anyway. We're just going to have the deforestation of the Amazon rainforest children. Here you go. I just want to share, I just want to show you the animals that be in the tide before the, the burning. After the burning of the Amazon rainforest. Here we go. Let me see if we can see it here. These are the ashes of the Amazon. There you go. It's a truly unique place. And it sucks in and stores some of the carbon we all produce. But it's under attack never before. 
This what the happened for the deforestation. Great swathes they cut down or they burned the forest. To work out why it matters, you have to get there to a rainforest that stretches beyond borders and is a true wilderness. You see, no trees have survived. They are all burned down. The natural disaster. And not, that just not keeps only the trees, itself. children. Not this only the trees. The vast for emergency help. Also, the wild animals the are being burned down we came because off the main of road the fire. We this huge plume above us. And the area that's burning is perhaps another mile or so in that direction. This one is the Amazon. Here you go. So possibly, I want to show you. There is I want to show here. you. There is nobody to stop it. I'm on this one here. Yeah. Environmentalists have long warned that the president of Brazil, environmentalists like Luciano, we cannot see. We cannot see the animals that are being burned down. Okay, just a moment. I just want to show you this one because of a lot of animals. Let's see. A moment. Okay, there you go. There you go. Oh my goodness, I don't want to see it. So before, uh, this one is not a little bit okay. Before this is one of the videos, one of the videos of the Amazon. Before, so this is a wild animal, koala, children. She's being burned down. You see, we have a lot of videos before in here. She's, she's crying for help. You see. And they are helping the koalas. This is what happened when animals burned the forest. It's not only the trees, it's also the animals, children. You see this one? Oh. These are koalas also. This is what happened when people burn down the forest oh my you see we don't know where they're going can a lot of firemen go there okay <laughs> but other than that, it's the only good thing about it. If we look out on the city, can't see it today. It's uh, terrible. So before, before children, when the when the Amazon forest was burned, 
Okay, so it has a large area that was being burned by people. Okay, so a lot of animals were dead. Okay, so we have koalas also. Koalas, they are being endangered also. So we're going to find another one video. They have a lot of video about the burning of Amazon rainforest, rainforest before. Till when? There you go. This one. Before going to our topic for today. in the fire. What is that? What animal is that, children? Can you guess what animal is that? Hmm? Again, please. Again, please. What animal is that? A kangaroo. A kangaroo. You see? That's because of the far the burning of forest. Oh, very thirsty. What animal is that? Oh, he's asking for more water. Those are animals. See, they are very thirsty. What happens? The little koala rescue. Koalas, koalas everywhere. Children, they are running for their life. This is my little baby. I'm cuddling. Just trying to collect as many yeah. black ones. And what is that? Towels. Okay, children. So that's one one of the videos about the burning of the bush fire about the Amazon rainforest before. Okay, so a lot of animals are dead. A lot of animals and a lot of animals are seeking for help for the humans. Okay, but but I don't wanna. There's something this video that very 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 sad before, but I cannot find it. I cannot find. It, okay, so that's human activity who causes the fire some some others say says that it's a climate change it's because of climate change so it have a bush fire okay it's not about it's not about that human we're gonna put some fire it causes a lot about the burning of forests it's because of the climate change climate change is caused by human also human activities also so anyway anything that happens in our in our planet earth it's because of us of our activities okay so this one is about the the video that i have played with the while ago is about the 
the the burning of forest okay the burning of forest caused by human activities okay so that the first one that is being affected is the wild animals okay so it's a wild animals okay now our lesson for today is about so we are finished with our recap of our can you hear me yes yes can you understand me when i talk can you understand me when i talk yes a little bit am i fast am i fast and uh, no no okay <laughs> okay so now we're going to have our lesson for today our main lesson for today we are finished with our recap so we have to do a recap to you and so that you can understand our lesson for today so that you can relate for our lesson for today okay so we have this one just a moment that we're just going to have the wild protection okay so what does people do to protect the the wild the wild animals okay so we're going to have this one so if people if animals were being killed because of human activities some people are saving animals also children so what does they do okay so just a moment there you go A moment, please. Wow. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Can you see my screen now, children? Can you see my screen now? There you go. Yeah. yeah. Uh, should we start from the very beginning? Protecting endangered species. So those are the endangered species that you have said a while ago. Three rhinos are killed every day. I, I, do you still remember the rhinoceros? Only the one hundred percent. Only ten percent is so. Only ten percent survive for now. Okay, so if the ten percent we're gonna we're gonna kill, we don't. The rhinoceros will be its instinct like dinosaurs, children. So it says in here three rhinoceros a day for the ten percent. So it's getting down the percentage. Oh, oh. We get the horns of the elephant and we sell it. This one is an illegal way. See? You cannot see that the inside contains of endangered species. Oh my goodness. Okay. What does people do? They kill animals not only for meat but also for money, children. Also for money.
you read what is on your screen, Sophia? Protecting endangered species. Species. We we all have a role to play. Okay. So what are you gonna do to protect the wild, the endangered species, children? Aside from, of course, you cannot tell all the hunters not to hunt hunt animals for food, right? What are you gonna do to help for the protection of those endangered species? What will you gonna do? Okay, I'm going to give you five points if you answer it correctly. Let's see. We still have 10 minutes, no worries. So what are you gonna do to protect the wild animals or the endangered species? You think, I'm going to give you two minutes to think. What are you gonna do? Isha. Yes? Read peace again, please. Okay, so what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do to protect the endangered animals? Okay, what are you gonna do to protect? Protect the walai. Sophia, can you see it in how How do you see it? Protect in Thai. Protect. Okay, thank you. How are you going to protect the animals, the endangered animals? Two minutes, still one. I'm going to give you five points if you can answer correctly. Are you ready? No. <laughs> okay, okay. One of the reasons why animals go extinct is because of deforestation, cutting down of trees in the forest. Forest. Why? Because wild animals or animals that lives in the jungle, one one of their home is the tree. Where does they get some food? On the trees also. Okay, that's one 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 clue, children. What else? People people burns burns plastics what else okay causes pollution land air water pollution okay that causes the animals go instinct okay so that's the second clue what else okay let's see one more just a moment one more minute to let the others think sophia Are you ready? Okay, children. Sophia, go on. You want to be the first one? Go on, Sophia. What are you going to do? One more tree. Plant more trees, great job. For that, the animals, we're going to have shelter and food to eat. Great job. What else aside from those? Aside from that? Anybody? Uh, we've started our class earlier, so I'm just going to let you go earlier. Yeah, yeah. What else? Yeah, yeah, go on. Yeah, yeah, go on. Don't kill it. Okay, of course. Do not kill animals. Great job. Yeah, yeah. One, 
two, three, four, five. What else, children, aside from do not kill animals, do not hunt animals, what else? Of course, we cannot say for the hunters that they stop killing animals. What else? Sophia, go on. Do not pollute the air. Do not pollute the air. Great job. What else? What else? Focus one. Do you not have anything in mind? To protect the endangered species or the endangered wild animals. Do you have anything in mind? Aside from do not pollute the air, what else? Do not kill or hunt animals for food, what else? As Sophia said a while ago, plant more trees, what else? Anybody? Aside from those, what are you gonna do? Children. What else? Oh, not, not only you. Okay, what else does people have to do? Okay. Anybody? Okay. Huh? Repeat again, please. What are you gonna do to protect the endangered species? Endangered animals. Okay, so we have learned before, we're going to have a recap again. We have learned before that animals go instinct because of what are those human activities. We have the deforestation. The burn, deforestation includes the burning of forests, cutting down of trees. Okay, what else? Because of human activities like air pollution, water pollution, pollution, it kills animals also. What else? Okay, so a while ago, Sophia answered, do not cut down trees. Okay, what else? Yaya said, do not hunt wild animals, which is right. Okay, so then... Um, hmm. Sophia answered again, do not pollute, pollute the air. Is that the air that you have said a while ago, Sophia? Yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, you are raising your hand. What, what else do you have in mind? What else do you have in mind? Yeah, yeah. Not hunting. Okay. Do not hunt animals for food. Okay, don't hunt, do not hunt animals for food. It's just the same, but when, when I'm going to give you points. A moment. What else, children? What else? Sophia, go on. Try not to recycle. Try to recycle your garbage. Okay, try try to recycle your garbage. Wait up. Just a moment. Boom. I'm gonna burn the forest. Boom. Burn the forest. My goodness, you are not protecting the wild animals. Boom. If I'm going to burn the forest. Yeah, yeah. Fresh a tea. Plant trees. Is that Sophia? Did you have said a while ago that one? Plant trees? Yes. Yes. What else, children? Or maybe. Though a reforestation. Deforestation. Deforestation is, is that. Reforestation is what it means. It's. Just planting trees. Okay, Sophia. Do not burn the forest. Do not burn the forest. Maybe, maybe that is where Boom was saying a while ago. Okay, we're just going to have Boom. Boom, do not burn the forest, okay? You forgot to write do not, okay? Instead of saying burn the forest, it should be do not burn the forest. 
<laughs> okay, so great job, children. What else? Do you still have something in mind? Okay, so we're going to have Sophia. How many points do you have? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. 25 points. So for Yaya, we have 5, 10, 15, 17 points. For Boom, we get, give Boom 5 points. Maybe he forgot to write do not, do not before burn the forest, okay? Boom, do not burn the forest, okay? It's bad. Okay, so children, that's all for today. I'm going to let you go two minutes before our time we're going to finish. Okay, so have a great day, children. See you again tomorrow for our continu continuation of our Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Goodbye.